I'm not one that thinks it's just in a retail apocalypse. Fair in enough. fact, I, I look to building businesses when things are tough. You just can't stay into legacies, you mm. know, and just be at the department stores like the Macy's and not change. You know, you have to change with the times. And so whether it was Rue and taking it over and building it to becoming a volatile business and viable business or during the recession in 2008, and nine, I was opening up over 100 stores a year. Year, um, it has a lot to do with not being afraid to take a stand, but not just what you want to do. It's really realizing what the customer wants gotcha. and really thinking about them. And people don't always do that, Dominic. Right. So to me, it was it was really, um, you know, you're absolutely right. There's, there's a look right now, 85 percent or more of retail business is still brick and mortar. Right. It's just there are going to be tons of consolidations. The bankruptcies, as you, I could go down the list of everything, you know, whether it's a pandemic, pandemic or not. Right. But but I believe that there's still opportunities, and now's the time sometimes to grab those opportunities. And that's what I like to teach and to go over with people so they can make the best of their lives. 